Hey right, guys, play fans here. Right, doggy dog's right behind me. Oh, behind me, right behind you. So do apologise if you hear her snoring. It is now twenty to eight at night, so she's normally about to go to sleep this time of day. So I do apologise if you hear her snoring from behind, and she is quite loud. Right, this is another budget gear video. Before I start again as well, I do apologise to Potato Head because I didn't do this one with you, but I didn't like it, so I'm redoing it. Okay. Right, today I'm going to be talking about these bottle pouches. This one here. This is my bag I take out when I go out with Dopey Dog. I don't take Dopey Dog out for walks. I take this bag with me. It's got everything I need for her when we're out. You know, just to go for a walk. I don't take the big bag because I want to take the big bag. I take this one because it's smaller and it's lighter. And it, all it's got in it is a treat, some water, her tennis balls and her bowl. So and sometimes some food. So this is what I want to talk about. So this pouch as you can see is a standard Molly pouch. It does fit a one litre bottle in here. I reckon it could I reckon it's a lot bit still smaller because of the lid. I think it's about an inch gap up here or still three. You do have a nice pouch in the front. Yeah and Basically, as you can see, put my I put my hand in. You can see my hand just disappears in the pouch. It doesn't look like it, but my hand disappears in it. I do have my water purification kit on the one on my rucksack. I will leave that in the one of the corners. I don't know which one it is. If you want to check that out, if you haven't seen that already, so you know how much stuff can actually fit in that front pouch. I don't have nothing in there right now because I don't need nothing in there. But as I said, that's a one liter bottle. Right, price. Hard to believe this one here, and I'll be truthful with you. I bought I spent six six ninety nine on this one. I have just looked online on Amazon this morning time for the exact same same one. Apologize about that. Yeah, that you can buy one of these. If I remember rightly, I think it's five seventeen five pound and seventeen p. So that is a bargain, in my opinion. They are as good as the Max Editions because my one I on my rucksack, on my big rucksack, I've had for three years, and it's never broke. It's the same one. I have got it caught beside the fire tomb, so quite close, so it's melted a hole in the side, but it's still going strong. So I'm not getting rid of it unless I need to. And if I need to try and spare it, I've got that one there now. So yeah, what else is it? And I know people say about Max Edition, but I'm going to say the price now. If I remember rightly, I think it's forty six fifty six, forty six pound and fifty six p. So it's quite a lot more expensive. I'm not grudging anybody to say don't go out and buy it because it's too expensive. If that's your choice, if that's what you want, you get it. But this is a budget gear video, yeah, and I'm trying to make it, make sure everything's a certain under a certain price. So that's why I'm going to leave it there, guys. I have to apologise as I said about this video about everything at the moment for this video because this video probably won't make sense but yeah that's the pouch i'm talking about i'll leave links in the description so i do apologize for you guys in america and kind of know that the links are in the uk because i do just shop in the uk online shops so if any of you guys want to put links in please do and i will pin it that i will pin the first link whoever puts it in thank you for watching do apologize as, as again same again same do apologize again and we will see you soon guys and in the next one hopefully and i'm being hopeful we'll be outside or i will be don't be don't want me okay very much bye guys